Not because he has provided for us. He has provided for us. The book of Psalms 145. Verse 16. The Bible says, Thou openest thy hand and you satisfy the desires of all living things. The Lord opened his good hands towards us this year. He supplied to our needs. Mm. Hallelujah. The Lord has supplied to our needs this year. We are saying thank you. You know, when we began this year, I know many of us, we had visions. Mm. Many of us, we had goals. Mm. Many of us, we had dreams. Yes. But regardless of the level that your needs have been met, Today, you need to understand that God has been involved. Mm. Praise the name of Jesus. Kama kanisa tulianza mrani, na buwa na mejusa idea. Hakuna kitu tumetamani kufanya as a church this year to Japan. Kwa naema ya mungu. Mkono wake umedua chuyo yetu. We have every reason to tell God thank you. Umedipia wa total school fees. Umesaidia, you know, people and all the extended family you need to tell God thank you you need to tell God thank you for different provisions and also at the extent towards your life finally today we are thanking God for his help and we have a lot of things to thank God for but for the sake of the service today I want us to uh, for the number four I want us just to tell God thank you for his help upon our lives Psalms 46 verse 1 Psalms 46 verse 1 The Bible says God is our refuge and our strength And then the Bible says and a very present help in trouble The Lord is our refuge and our strength This God is our very present help in the time of trouble. Other translation says in the time of need. I know in my know-how, every one of us this year, we have been helped by the Lord in different areas of our lives. One of the idea. Praise the name of Jesus. And so today, we just need to tell God thank you. Hallelujah. Now, I want, I want us to show you how we need to thank God. Number one, we thank God by singing and worshiping Him. We thank God by singing and worshiping Him, just as we have done 